think homosexuals have too many rights. I feel like if you look like a fucking man, I should be able to punch you in your fucking face like a man. I shouldn't have to go to court and get tried like I beat up a woman because you want to act like a bitch. You know, I'm going to tell y'all what happened to me. I went to court and shit. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I got into a fight with some gay guys in the club, me and my brother. Now, my brother, this nigga, a homophobe or something. I don't know what the fuck wrong with him. He see one of them niggas, he just want to kill him like a Jamaican. Kill the boxy boy! Pussy war! Like, calm down, Buju Bantan. You know? Make a long story short, we get into a scuffle with the other people. So now I got to go to court. And I'm thinking to myself, I had a fist fight with a grown man in the club. They probably give me a weekend in the local county jail. I could do that. I got braids now. I think I'm tough. <laughs> Nigga, do you know when I stepped up in front of the judge? She had a whole other agenda. This bitch gonna look at me and say, sir, in your case, we looking to give you six to eight years for a felony hate crime. <laughs> she said, did you hear me? I said, uh-uh. She said, six to eight years for a felony hate crime. Now look at me. No shit about me say thug, criminal, or none of that shit. Nigga, I'm five foot seven and I'm light skinned. I'm average size for an eighth grade little girl. Ain't nobody scared of me. Fuck I'ma do for eight years in prison. I looked, I started thinking, I was like, you know what, I'm a comedian. I act on stage every night. I'm gonna act tonight. I looked at that bitch and I said, shit, hold on, fish. I think you done made a motherfucking mistake. Bitch, this was a domestic. I've been knowing Charles puts the ass for years. Somebody come tie my motherfucking shirt. <laughs> Fuck y'all, the domestic is only two weeks. My name damn fool, I'm out this bitch. Shot down, I got you. It's so wild for me moving to New York. Cause I moved straight into the West Village. So y'all know, you know, know the first day in my new neighborhood, I was just walking around laughing like a motherfucker. <laughs> hey man, look, look. There go some gay guys. <laughs> hey, look, there go some more hood and kiss it. <laughs> hey, 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 what the fuck, man? <laughs> I never seen so many gay people in my life. Started having nightmares, man. The same nightmare every night. I'm walking home late one night by myself. <laughs> Nobody else is around. And all of a sudden, this guy comes out of nowhere, man. He puts a gun up to my head, you know, and he doesn't want my money or anything like that. He just says, click, click, click. Suck my dick. <laughs> That's when I woke up every night. <gasps> I told my boy about it. I said, man, I've been having this dream. You know what he said? He said, yo, Dave, I would bite his shit off. I don't have the heart to bite somebody's penis off, man. You know, you'd be on man like, ah! Ah! I would think about it. I'm not going to lie. I know every guy would. As soon as I see that, I'm going to be like, ah! I'm gonna bite his dick off. I'm gonna bite his fucking dick off. <laughs> ah, click! <laughs> hey, don't tell nobody, man, all right? But I gotta live. I'm gonna tell you what, I'm a scuffler. That's what I am. I'm a great scuffler. You know what a scuffler is? All it is, that's a nigga that is real hard to get a hold of. That's all. It's real hard to grab me. I'm a brilliant scuffler. Get back, nigga. <laughs> nigga, it take a lot to get me, nigga. It take a lot. Yeah. You got to be patient to fight me, nigga. It take a lot of time. <laughs> I got into a scuffle with this nigga at the gym. Some true shit. Some naked dude. Some naked dude at the gym trying to have a conversation with me. I don't want to talk to you while your dick is out. I don't like that, you know? You wait till you put that up, then we can talk. Then we can finish this conversation. Because I got a little butt. That's the first thing I think about. On well, some real shit, like, if, if a nigga really wanted to write me, what can I really do? Be honest. Like, if you get past my scuffle, that's it. I, I got to take one for the team. 
That's all, that's all I got. If you get past my stuff, hey, get the fuck off. That's it, nigga. I don't want that problem. I don't like that. I don't want that at all. <laughs>